Good morning, staff and students. Hi, my name is Mario, and I'm coming to you live from the WLNK studios. Today is Friday, March 6, 2015. Elk Grove Village is expected to have a high of 30 and a low of 7 with partly cloudy skies. Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for a linked pride pledge. I promise to respect myself and the rights and properties of others. I am alone responsible for my actions and attitudes. I pledge to do my best at all times to be a positive role model. Our pledge people for today are... Justin, Mary, Alessandro, Victoria, Emma, Happy birthday, Maya. Birthday wishes go out to Georgia, room 205, Austin, room 203, Francesca, room 204, Caitlin, room 112, Ethan, room 102, Maya, room 110, and James, room 206. Say Spirit Day. Teachers, please find the percentage of students who wore spirit wear. Send the student to drop off slips outside Mr. Anconcio's room, 202. And now a word from Mr. Wolbecker. Good morning, everybody. Happy Friday. It's great to be with you. Hopefully you can hear me. My voice might not all be here today, but my happiness is, and I'm very happy to recognize some of our winners today. <clears throat> so here we go. We're gonna start in kindergarten with Max in Mrs. Bartholomew's classroom for the commitment key for remembering to bring your red folder home and you've been completing your homework each night. Awesome job, Max. Remember, if I call your name, come on down to my office like I'm gonna call Sarah in sixth grade in Mrs. Roncancio's room for showing integrity. You've, uh, you value getting your good grades, producing your best work, and including others. And this is all reflected in your focus, effort, and kindness in class. Great job, Sarah. All right, we have another sixth grader, Alexa, in Miss Kim's classroom for the commitment key. You are committed to your learning, and Miss Kim can always count on you to produce work that goes above and beyond expectations. Nice job. All right, we're gonna drop down one grade level to fifth grade, and we're going to recognize Julia in Mrs. Gallo's classroom for failure leads to success. You've been making a conscious effort to try your hardest and work until you complete a task and understand any mistakes that you might have made. Great job, Julia. All right, here we go to our dual language classroom. Carly in Ms. Zavala's classroom for the integrity key. Uh, you are demonstrating the ability to work through a dilemma in class. Sounds like you were successful. Good job, Carly. All right, let's recognize some staff members for today. We have Mr. Daryl for the commitment key, nominated by our very own Mrs. Hyland for your assistance earlier this week when we had uh, that special morning with mom. Uh, you went above above and beyond, Mr. Darrell, the entire morning and, of course, leading up to that event. Thank you for all your help. All right, and let's recognize our two wonderful secretaries in the office, Mrs. Willis and Mrs. Mall for the flexibility key, also nominated by Mrs. Hyland for always having a smile and helping everyone, especially me, uh, that comes into our school. All right, and finally, we have a new classroom for Pride of the Month, and it is... First grade, Mrs. Noverall's classroom. Great job, you've earned the pride of the month for demonstrating respectful and responsible behavior in the hallway. I'm very proud of you guys. Okay, so if I called your name earlier in the announcements, come on down to my office. Everybody have a great day. Hopefully you don't lose your voice today. Keep on rocking. Thank you for tuning in for your morning news. Have a fabulous, so fantastic French Fry Friday.